Hi guys, it's Kate. So today I'm gonna to be showing you some really cool 3D prints to sell online. It's more and more popular to use your 3D printer to make money online, selling fun objects that you can print for a pretty low cost. Uh, popular sites are like Etsy or Facebook Marketplace to sell your items. So here is uh, the collection of 3D prints that I have chosen today. I'm gonna to go through each one of them. There's a lot of really fun and uh, cool 3D prints today. Uh, just a reminder that when you are looking to sell 3D prints online, you need to check for commercial use rights. So I bought, I got all of these from printables.com and I looked to make sure that there was an option for commercial use with all of them. But just please double check before you sell that you have the commercial use rights. So let's show you all the options. Okay, so here we have these really cool cat themed bookends. Um, again, I think these would be awesome to sell online. Cat products, there's so many cat lovers out there that I think these would be easy to sell on Marketplace or Etsy. Um, they act as bookends and I thought it was very fitting to put the Dogman series in between them. Um, these could definitely be uh, increased in size as well make them a little bit more sturdy um, but I liked to have them at this scale so they were more manageable on my 3d print bed so these stackable battery crates crates are super helpful for organizing your batteries they have a whole bunch of different variations for your AAA AA your 9 volts and more available um, they stack up nicely which is great for storage there's also a tray that you can 3d print to put them all organized together. I just love being able to put these actually in my drawers and have the batteries accessible and easy to use. Really like this for organization. And I think that these um, would sell really well um, for those who are wanting to organize them. So this was a cool bowl um, that helps you to organize your yarn. So it just keeps your yarn from tangling up and it threads through here. Um, actually like knitting and crocheting is really popular on sites like Etsy and Marketplace. And so this kind of thing is actually likely to sell well. So there are a lot of um, knitters and crocheters who are buying things online. Fidget toys are another really popular item to 3D print and sell online. I actually made a whole bunch of fidget toys for my son's birthday party and gave them away in loot bags. So you could certainly sell them as a collection and do like a loot bag theme or a stocking stuffer type of thing. I'll link to my full video on 3D printed fidget, um, fidget toys so that you can see all of the options available. Another really great option to sell for those who like to organize and who doesn't like to organize are these lid holders. So these just go right in my pantry doors and then I can organize and stack my lids and they're much more accessible. Um, super easy to print. And again, this is something that you could um, sell as part of a bundle of organizing um, or sell on its own. Probably due to the size, it would be best to sell this more in like a Facebook marketplace type of situation. This is a really cool idea that I thought would be fun uh, to sell online. So these are actually holders for putting in your trunk to try to keep the things in your trunk from shifting all over the place. So if you buy, um, you know, some um, laundry detergent or something like that, or have a grocery bag, you'll put these around it. I'll just use um, this uh, tissue paper as an example. And then you just stick some Velcro onto the bottom and then it will stick to your car. Um, so uh, I think this was a genius idea. Uh, again, it serves a useful purpose. It doesn't take up that much space, so it'd be easy to ship and sell. I think this is a really cool one. So I really like the look of these coasters. They're modern, um, hexagonal shape. They come in different patterns. And then of course you can print them in different colors. I just think they look really modern. Again, these would be super easy to pack and sell. So this is something that'd be good to sell online. Um, and again, would be reducing your shipping costs. And I think they look great and they don't take a lot of filament. It's a great option. 
I know this doesn't seem like the most exciting option, but sometimes the soap dish, something useful is actually what sells really well. I think it would be cool to personalize this. So to go into Tinkercad or whatever type of software you want to use and maybe add someone's name, this would be like a great gift for someone going off to college or uh, for their dorm. So again, this soap dish and it has this nice um, draining function. It's a great option of something to sell um, that's useful and practical. So this is a cool take on the piggy bank. It's this castle coin storage. There is a lid that you can also print and place here to keep your coins stored safely. So what you do is you just put the coin here and then it falls down the slide here. This is all print in place, no supports needed, really cool design. And um, I think this would be a great gift for something to sell online. So another practical one is this mason jar um, fruit fly trap. So this just attaches to any mason jar. This was just a mason jar I had laying around my house. So again, you can sell these like this and they pack up pretty easily to be able to ship off. And then the buyer will just fill their mason jar with um, a sugary type of um, water um, so that it attracts the fruit flies and then they become trapped here. I uh, really like this practical idea and again I think this is something that would sell well. So obviously this rubber band gun is pretty awesome in itself but I think you can think outside the box in terms of selling these. Of course you could sell it as is but I think it'd be fun to create like a loot bag for kids and sell a 3D printed loot bag. Um, so again parents are always looking for fun products for loot bags and this would be a great example. Um, so this one you can actually load three rubber bands at once so there is a third one it's black it's hard to see and there we go each one goes as you press the trigger. It's pretty cool and my kids love this one. So finally, this is something that I actually made again for one of my son's birthday parties. I made each child a uh, 3D printed pencil holder and then I put inside the typical loot bag type of um, options. So some pens and pencils, but also a little bit of candy and some 3D printed fidgets as well. So I think this is a great way to offer personalized loot bags or prizes, Easter, Valentine's gifts for kids. Personalized stuff always does super well on things like Etsy and Marketplace. And so you can offer to personalize for whoever is your buyer. Um, I have a tutorial on my website on how to make this one on Tinkercad super easy. And so I'll link to that in the description. So there you have it. There's some really cool options of 3D prints to sell. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content.